Girl, she basically tells me walking around with stank breath. What's good, y'all? Welcome back to another day in the vlog. Well, this is actually a new vlog, I do believe. So welcome back to the start. Welcome or welcome back to the start of a new vlog. I'm your girl, Ash. If you're new here, stick around for a little bit. Check out a couple of videos, you know. See if you like it, girl. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel. If you do, hit the like button on this video if you enjoy it. And let's see. Get into what to do this because you know your girl always got something to do. Today is Wednesday. It's about this clock is still wrong. So if it's going on 9, it should be technically going on 10. And, well, one, Journey's back at daycare. So we got her back at daycare officially today. Um, I think I told y'all that Ashton got pink eye. So he's still home um, with me. So I need to do my Married at First Sight recap. I need to edit the previous vlog so I can get that up for y'all. Um, at this rate, since it's Thursday, I'll probably have it set up and prepared to go up on Sunday. And let's see, what else? We don't got no shifts today, so we may go on demand with GoPuff. But no, we need to get Jada a orange shirt. And I've been dying to go to Marshalls. I haven't been to Marshalls in so long. And I've been dying. So we probably going to try to go to Marshalls today. Especially since I have Yo-Yo. Like, he will be easy to shop with. I've been needing to go and get this. But since I had all the littles, basically, I was like, yeah, nah. Journey not going to let me. Because I know I'm going to go in there. And I'm going to want to, you know, look at more stuff than just that shirt. And, yeah, so... I got to take y'all along with me when we do that because, for one, that's just supposed to be something that's supposed to be already a part of my channel on a daily. So, I'm just going to come in, open up this vlog for y'all really quick, you know, get our vloggy vlog started. So, I'm going to get this breakfast. I'm going to watch, oh, technically, really what I'm about to watch is um, my brother gave me his GoPro camera. So technically, I could use that. I just need to get a memory card. But as well, I've been thinking about buying a vlogging camera. So I'm about to see what's the best. Like, I have some cameras written down that I potentially wanted to buy. But that was, like, when I first started, like, YouTube. And that was, like, in 2021. So I'm about to see, you know, what they now consider to be some of the top vlogging cameras. So I'm about to watch a couple of videos. Just I just got two videos for that. Um, compare those write some notes you know make ashes breakfast and then you know it's roll up time and we're gonna watch married at first sight so i'm gonna get a chaw later all right what's up babes happy friday it's friday night i'm drinking midnight mm, shaking all around it's definitely not friday night though it's like more like friday afternoon um up journey's at daycare yo yo still at home with me jada's at school we me and yo yo are about to get in the stores and try to find jada an orange shirt i could easily go to like walmart get her a plain orange shirt but that ain't even that style that even not flow plus i think i just have not want to have an excuse to go to Marshall's so that's what we have to do so I'm gonna see if we can find one in Marshall's if it is a Target over there so I could slide to Target but I ain't necessarily trying to spend Target money you know so um but uh I think I feel like something else is over there maybe a Ross I don't know I feel like something else is over there Plato's Closet is also over there um, and then the mall is across the street if it gets to be that necessary. Um, and then that mall isn't like a, I don't even know if they got like a Forever 21 or H&M in there or like what they, I don't even know. I don't even know, but I had to come in here, you know, start this vlog, get this vlog on going, let y'all know what the plans are, what we are doing today, and... Yeah, so come on, just come on. In the store, we gotta go look for some things, pick up some things. Yeah, y'all, I feel like, no, not a five and below, though. Maybe, you know what, I might be able to get to actually 
go for you a basketball. Yeah, they, I need need a basketball. A, they say you need to practice, practice that basketball. Y'all, I feel like a kid about to go into a candy store. Candy store? I feel like I have to Yo, yo, shh. That's, that's not what I'm saying. <laughs> I feel like I have, no, I have to pride myself from walking in Marshalls for so long. And I don't know what to do with myself. And I have to throw myself back in. Because I can't be going up in here acting a fool, acting like I done lost my mind like I'm trying to buy up everything that I see. Like, that's not what we the mother. <laughs> Grab a basket, yo-yo, for me, please. Yeah. Not that, that I think we might need one, but... Okay. I have to avoid looking at the shoes. not like been in here there's so many people in here i feel nervous about vlogging and this music playing so y'all didn't know what i gotta do i'll see y'all later hey babe so we are back from um oh that's a cute bag so we're back home i know i did not like take y'all shopping with me i did not do <clears throat> none of the vlogging that i thought i was gonna do but i'm not even gonna lie y'all as much as i thought that i was gonna be like I had I basically just had a one track mind when I went into Marshalls, so that was finding this on shirt. You see, though, I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back to Marshalls. We're gonna get our own just us Marshalls experience, and because like I said, it was something that was supposed to be part of my content anyway. Just like shop with me, just because like I just love Marshalls that much that like y'all, I would literally be at Marshalls like once a week once a week if not a couple of times a week sometimes or whatever or whatnot so I, I i just want to add a little bit of um besides the vloggings into my channel and i don't know just give y'all more of me and secure some brand deals like i'm not even gonna play with y'all we, we, we so basically look we didn't find nothing in marshall's though i didn't find nothing in marshall's and so um we ended up Ross was over there, like I thought, but we ended up going to Five and Below instead. And we're just a little, she ain't chefing it up right now. But I did find her like a oversized hood, like an oversized sweatshirt. This is what like looks like me. It looks like it's very much like a chill wear type of thing, but it was perfect. It's on. I think I had the word like obsessed on it. I didn't even think that she would be with it, but she was like, I sent her a picture. Oh my God freaking god y'all this bag it's little as hell but that is so freaking cute okay focusing so i have not watched a haul video in like a long time and brawny is probably the only person that i watch hauls from um besides people who may just do hauls and like their videos but she specifically just does like her content on YouTube is just like hauls, clothing hauls, accessories hauls, and stuff like that, or whatever, whatnot. And so her most recent video is just like an all black haul and this black studded rhinestone. Matter of fact, I mean, y'all want to see this? Y'all look at this bag, y'all. Look, look at that. Look, look, look at that. Yeah. I'll um I put her channel name in the um right here. If you're interested in following Brawny, and I think her same name, she has the same name on um, Instagram. Um, yeah, she just does like a lot of fashion content. Like that's her, you know, niche aesthetic or whatever, or whatnot. Ooh, that's a that's a cute bag too, girl. Okay, y'all, we focus it, we focus it. So yeah, so um, actually got stuff too, which I was not even expecting to go in there and go as ham as I did. We spent $78 in freaking five and below because of the buying up shirts. He ended up wanting stuff. He ended up getting like two posters, a book, um, a toy. And we both got like these old cheap AirPods and which listening to it, it's, it's a re yeah, it's $8 for a reason, but Hey, they will work. I'm not even going to complain about these $8 things. They work. Uh, I can hear clearly. So that's really all that matters. So I'm not going to show what I got the kids, but I'll show you what I got outside of that. I got me a new car mount because I wanted one that earlier, well, this wasn't necessarily for vlogging purposes. This was more like for, you know, 
all the delivering that I do, you know, for GPS wise or whatever, whatnot. I just want another place to put my phone besides like on the window, on the windshield, because I feel like the windshield distorts my vision, um, you know, seeing things or whatever or whatnot. So I wanted to get something that goes on a vent but didn't block the vent. And so far this works okay. So they had these press-ons, which I, I just keep buying press-ons and I've yet to apply these press-ons. So they had these, which I thought were very cute for $4.50. And then I ended up buying a couple of shirts, which is just a phase, perfect for where I'm at right now. I'll probably hang these up. Um, This Cali, California baby. I don't know what it was about this. I wasn't even necessarily in love with the shirt. I don't know why it just looked plain on this white tee. And, but I was just like, but you know what, Ashley? How you gonna spruce it up? Is you gonna make it a crappie toppy. So I'm gonna end up cutting it. Uh, Not like a full on crappie toppy, like right below the boob. So I feel like that would be really cute probably if you did that versus like the more like hip waist. Uh, not the hip, but the waist like, like just like below the belly button like type type crappy toppy so we'll figure that out but i fit, felt like the california baby would be really cute they really had some cute shirts and they really had some shirts that made me also want to maybe step out of my comfort zone and not do my normal thing but i was like another day another day because i could have easily spent a hundred dollars alone just on some of their shirts and i'm a graphic tee type of girl i love a good shirt it did this uh moody sometimes moody shirt um, which very well I could turn into a crop top, but no, I don't think I am. I think I'm just going to leave this as, uh, you know, a large, because I usually do mediums in my, uh, t-shirts, but we'll let that just be like a little oversized with some jeans, pants, whatever, whatnot. Then we ended up at the, um, hair store after me and your yo had got something to eat. I ended up getting him up. We were going to go to Dick's, but I ended up going to, uh, Amazon and just ordered him a basketball off of Amazon. Um, after we left, um, five and below, he was pretty much shopped out because Loki, I was almost ready to go back into Marshall's, but I was like, yeah, yeah, I think I didn't, I think I've already did enough for the boy. Like, yeah, as much as he has patience for his mother, he ain't got that much patience. So that's why I was more like, like, yes, as you do these trips when it's just you, when you don't have to worry about the kids, nobody rushing you, nobody help. Like, yeah. So, um, I know I was talking about trying to fix some of my own locks that are thinning um like at the roots or whatever whatnot or even in the middle so i got um the crochet hook needles i got one in 0.5 and one in well it's a double hook in 0.5 and this is a double and a single hook in 0.75 um from what it seems these are the two sizes more or less that i probably more or less should need and since technically I realized that if it's I am going to end up retwisting my hair soon and I'm coming, I'm running out of the my gel, we won, went on and got the lock booster to try that out and see how we like on retwisting our locks, y'all. So that's like our like mini haul. So I'm about to, you know, chill. I need to figure out what we're going to do for dinner. I kind of want to do crumble cookies. I kind of want to do something sweet. But right now what I'm about to do is I'm just about to relax a little bit because we just end up basically picking Jada up from school because her bus wasn't, her bus didn't come. So after we have went to five and below, got something to eat and then that's when she had texted me. And so I was like, oh, well, what can we do? Got the hiccups now because in an hour we got to pick her up. And so I was like, oh, we're right, <clears throat> right beside the hair store. Let me at least see if I can find these crochet needles that I need. And then, yeah, so I see, goodness, I seen two techniques, one where you kind of based on using your own lock to repair the lock and one where you need like weave. And one of my locks are, was repaired by weave. Like you probably, probably can't even tell anymore because it probably has grown so much because it was one of like my baby locks in the front and it was one of the shorter ones but i think like now this person i didn't cut it she didn't probably like because i really feel like it might have been her 
but yeah one of my locticians had repaired one of my locks by doing the weave portion and so um i did not have as much time what well, i did have the time but this accident called said he had used the bathroom so that's what it was so i didn't have that as much time as i wanted to focus on like a specific type of hair because it sounds like i need like a really kinky hair um to work with so i might just watch more videos try to see if somebody recommends a certain type of hair so i know what to go in the store looking for so yeah yeah so i hope you know hope y'all enjoyed you know seeing what i shop for today and like i said we i'm just going to go ahead and chill this is probably going to end the vlog uh this day's vlog um because like i said i'm going to chill i'm about to roll up you guys smoked all day so your girl's about to roll up watch some vloggies or not even just watch vloggies catch up on some of my youtuber fave youtubers and i got a shift from 10 to 12 so that's my evening so i will catch y'all later morning babes happy saturday it is early it's about technically yeah this clock is still behind i have not pushed forward my radio car clock yet um it's seven o'clock going on eight we're about to slide over to dollar general your girl be trying to be like like trying to save like a little down a little coin so she do a little coupon a little here and there not nothing too crazy um i got introduced to dollar general and some of the little coupons so if they be feel like i'd be like it's a good enough deal or whatever whatnot i go ahead and slide in there so i need to get some household items so and then you know on saturdays they have their uh five dollars off 25 or more so let's see what i can what i can get what i'll save what y'all get what i'm saying like what i got what the coupon was for basically like the total all that like little kind of like little stuff so yeah let's like go a little shopping um i technically been up since like early morning we um i went and uh did an early amazon shift this morning which i didn't realize that i don't know if it was a sunday it's the weekend but it was a lot of people and that may be what it was it was a lot of people um it was a lot of people out there I mean, a lot of people to the point, like even the, they have like another parking lot and that little small parking lot is usually on the side of the building. Usually uh, is usually empty. I mean, that jink was jumping this morning, y'all jumping. But yeah, so um, it was like a four to 7.30 or something like that. I was done by, um, by, by about 6.30 basically, actually. Um, so yeah, one too bad. Um, I was in uh an area that was like 30 to 40 minutes away from here so i'm not complaining at all you also got angles a little different because i'm using the i took the uh ah, i knew it was gonna get stuck on something basically this is what i was using at first you know the basic this jank and i took it off so, all right, I'm rambling. I'll see y'all at the store. Okay, babes, we've made it back from the store. I just want to go over my receipt because I honestly don't feel like I still got the $5 off. And even though it says you can't come by on coupons, I feel like this coupon lady said that basically I still should have been able to still get $25 off as long as I still spend $25. Um, so I'm gonna go over this receipt real quick. I meant to show y'all more of my shopping trip, but I meant to show y'all more of my shopping trip, but um, I wanted to make sure I got the right stuff, had the right items, so I can make sure I got the coupons off. Either way, I didn't end up spending what I wanted to spend. Really, Journey? <laughs> I did end up spending thirty dollars, which was which was about my goal. So I'm not mad, but I'm like. Where's my five dollar coupon at? So let me just go and look over this real quick, and I'm gonna come back to y'all. What? What? Okay, y'all. So I had to go in, tidy up everything, go over everything, make sure 
everything was right and they do basically each item got an additional store coupon and the store coupon for each uh basically did add up to five dollars so i did get my five dollars off my total savings was 14.50 um y'all over you know i be trying to understand like the math and like i, I don't really understand it y'all it just be like all about my budget was thirty dollars, like I said, and I met my budget. I went a little bit over because I got these kiss nails, which I did not need, but I thought they were, you know, this natural look was just too cute, so I had to have them. Which we'll go ahead and start off with. Um, they were two hundred five, and I basically got them for uh one seventy eight. This I did not have a coupon for, so, so the one seventy eight was just with the store discount. Um, I got some Motrin because my tooth, y'all, has been just driving me crazy. So, I just really just got this just to get me through this pain. Just in case in the event that, I need something stronger, really. But just in case the event that they don't end up pulling or doing whatever to this tooth. When I go on Monday, I actually think. So, the Motrin was five fifty. I had a digital coupon for $2. Plus, with the store coupon, $3.03. Um, our Tide, which, oh, and this was the 24 count, um, 24 count of Motrin, as you can see. Um, a 48, uh, load of Tide original, which was $9.95. I had a dollar fifty coupon, digital coupon, and then with the store coupon, it was $7.31 for that. Um, like I said, I only got a little Dawn, um, because I do, uh, wash here and there and there's just it's like a couple of things that just need washing so um that i need to wash by hand like my certain type of knives or whatnot so the dawn was 125 um the coupon was for the bigger size but um i ended up paying 108 with the store coupon that leaves we just did our motrin okay so the swiffer stuff was to buy two like starter kits and i guess maybe something else and basically buy two like a starter kit and then it said or buy like two like refill items or whatnot so and then you would get five dollars off uh the swiffer jet pads were ten dollars for 12 and um i got the cleaner thingy as well this was 675 so they took the five dollars off of uh, this and then the store coupon so I only paid a dollar 52 for this and then with the store coupon um, I paid 864 for this so in total technically what I paid so 10 six so 1675 and then 10 I'm mean 16 17 16 15 40 30 11 11 75 ish or whatnot um, if we're thinking about it together, or technically not even that, if I ate eight, nine, eleven, yeah, 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 about, about like ten dollars, something like that, ten, eleven dollars, or whatnot. Um, so then I got a, I think it's like an eight count, yeah, eight count, good size roll sheet, um, of Scott's toilet paper, which I had a digital coupon for, uh, which was, um, excuse me, it was $9.75 dollar coupon plus the store coupon $7.56. And then I just got one paper towel, because y'all know we don't really use much paper towels over here. That was a dollar with the store coupon. That was 83 cents. Like I said, store uh, total savings of $14.50. Did any of these items make sense? Would you have gotten any of these items for the prices that you would have? Does this make you want to be like, ooh, maybe I need to download the Dollar General app and, you know, bust it down with them? Or whatnot. I'm gonna definitely try to be busting it down with them on these Saturdays where you can get this 25%. That's extra 25, 25, 20. This extra five dollars off, 25 or more, especially when needing like the household household item stuff. Um, because I was gonna get more, but I was like, no, actually, stick to your thirty dollars. You said only you want to only spend thirty dollars. I was gonna get the, some refills for the um the airwigs, but I was like the plugins, but I was like. This can wait. This coupon doesn't even expire till next month. So just wait. So basically, we are going to be able to get five air wicks for the price of two, at least in Dollar General. 
I don't know how much they are in any other stores or whatnot, but um, they're like $12 for five in Dollar General. And then they were, I do the 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, yeah, and then they were $5 off. Um, so $7, and then they're like six seventy five for just two. So, yeah, you're basically paying for two. Yeah. No, what, what am I talking about? Yeah, you're basically paying for two because, like I said, when you're paying seven dollars and usually for two, they're like six seventy five. So yeah, that's that's. It's like uh, that sounds like a pretty good deal to me. So, um, yeah, y'all. So Jada has an event today, uh, um, for a dance team. They are doing a, a little performance at a Stop the Violence event today. So we just have that going on, and that's really about it. Yeah, I'm about to um do some cleaning or whatnot now that i got this you know our swiffer pad things i can really mop this floor so i think i'm about to push the table and the chairs into the living room so i can really like get a good sweep and mop done so yeah we gonna catch y'all Like, hold on, hold on. Bahama Breeze. Bahama Breeze is ghetto. The ghetto. There's <laughs> ghetto in there, Mom. I'm so serious. Yo, yo, stop we crying. Are you trying to look for it? Mom, we should go to Bahama Breeze when we leave here. What's it say it closed at 3 o'clock. Yeah, yo, you gotta, um... Put your, tuck your hands in there. Maybe it started at 3 o'clock. Maybe you think it closed at 3 o'clock. Because it looked like, why are they still setting up or something like that? Hey y'all, we are here for this Stop the Violence event. Jada is supposed to be performing with her dance team. It's Saturday afternoon. Oh Girls, why you are fussing and complaining already? I don't understand. So I broke out the good old GoPro, y'all. Come to find out, I actually already had a mini Nobody no, nobody wanna hear that. Why are you fussing at him like that? Stop fussing at him like that. He like, Leave him alone. He's getting himself together. Leave him alone. Like, find him. But yeah, I was so ready to go online and buy one. And I don't know. I just noticed something about... I don't know. I just noticed something. I can't even remember. And I was like, wait. I might have, like, one myself. And boom. So... Because I don't know how the footage is going to look yet. You know, I'm technically going to be recording on my phone. But I'm going to get some footage on the GoPro. And if it's a go, the GoPro just might be it. You know, we we, we you know we might not even need the camera right now. You know, like, mm. keep that little money in my pocket, you know. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That cop seemed really deep. But yeah, y'all, so... We're just going to be sitting here in the car until, what time is it, 1.43? Well, what time is the coach going to get here? I don't know. Mm. <laughs> Ma, do not say that on here like that. She might be watching. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What you writing?
days. I don't even know if I checked in with y'all after Jada's event yesterday. But hey, happy Sunday. Um, me and the kids are up. They wanted to do um, Applebee's yesterday, but I had a shift. So I told them that we would do Applebee's today. Um, Applebee's is like our favorite chill family sit down restaurant. The kids love it. I love it. It'd it be a vibe for us. So we about to do that. But just a recap on yesterday. So the event yesterday was a Stop the Violence event. And they were doing like a walk or whatever or whatnot. Wasn't a long walk. But your girl did not come there prepared to do no walking. Prepared to even do the walk. This dance team with this coach, this majorette team. I want her to do it, but we might just be finding another team next year. I don't, I don't know. Like, just more information just could have been given. We was prepared to even. Either way, we were going to do the walk, but Journey's um, stroller is, her bougie stroller is done for. I need to just throw it away. Matter of fact, we need to take trash out and I'm going to put it in a dumpster and she's going to get an umbrella stroller. She's at that age anyway. So, um... Just when we were about to go do the water, I realized the stroller was like acting crazy. And it's not just one wheel, it's just both wheels. And I was like, all right, like we're not going to make it. It was at a park. It was being hosted like at a park. They had like, you know, they served us food or whatever. They had local rappers. They had our dance team perform, which, you know, you saw in the footage there. Um, but like I said, it was at a park. So we did a little walk in around the community center building, found the playground, and boom. We were good. The littles played on there until they came back. Ashton got his face painted. Overall, it was nice. Um, I wish I could have got into it more. And maybe it was just because, like... And it's like, well, Ashley, why did you have to know somebody? Why did you have to, like... I just could not, you know, just get into it, y'all. You know, like... And I get it. Overall, it's like, stop the violence. It should be a big thing. Like, I'm here. I'm going to support... But, yeah, once Jada was done performing one, Jada, for whatever reason, just wasn't feeling it. Which is, like, so weird. Because it's, like, she wanted so bad to be on a team like this. And it's given, like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We shall see. Um, if this isn't even it, we're not done with activities. She's going to have something to do. Just like Ashton starts basketball next week. So, y'all stay tuned for that. So, that was our day. So we came back. I fed them once we left the event because uh, they had hot dogs. Um, I think they had chicken. I feel like they had ribs. By the time we got the ribs, ribs was gone. The chicken was almost ready, but the, uh, Jada was just so ready to go. It had gotten cold. So we booked out of there uh, and feeding them cookout. By the time we went home, chill for a second, it was time for me to start a shift. I thought I was going to go to Fat Tuesdays, you know, since I had an 8 to 11, so I was doing a late night shift. I got there like 11.30, and according to the door, they closed at 2 o'clock. Security was like, yeah, we're done letting people in for the night. Shimmy, shimmy, cocoa, what? Okay, let me, let me, let me, let me focus for, for that pickup on, 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 on the... And we want no issues from what's name. Because I already had, like, silence area. I didn't realize that um, one of Robin Thicke's songs was picking up that good on that on last week's video. In the beginning of the Big Lots. In the beginning of the Big Lots portion. And I, it's just quiet. It wasn't quiet at first. I just... I didn't feel like going back and trying to, like, edit the video. So, I was like, YouTube, just mute the section and just keep it going. So, um... That's what I'm about to go do. We might go to Dee Dee's. I fucked Jada so much. Like, her and her daddy be talking so much crap about Dee Dee's or whatever or whatnot. But, um, I watched Jane and Janine. She's one of, um, a big subscribe, a big YouTuber on here. And she talks about Dee Dee's a lot. And her Dee Dee's always just be having, like, some stuff. Like, um, she had just went to Dee Dee's. And they had had, like, the, um, the facial turner by the Bronner or Browns guy. That... She had just got some good stuff. What's up, yo yo? Yeah, I do believe it's pretty cool outside. So yeah, you're definitely gonna need a jacket. Did you but yeah, that so. Like yep, I sure am. It's nice. I like that. Shut up, Jada. That's that's basically saying that you don't like it like this, but I like it like this, so that's all that matters. Who told her she couldn't? She didn't. She wasn't gonna have a coat. 
Exactly. So stop bringing me up in conversation. Uh, well, she and plus she has long sleeves on. You don't have long sleeves on. I know, because it's a coat. All coats have long sleeves. Hey, y'all. Hello, I got this. Actually, they don't want Y'all going to work with me. Y'all going to have to work with me, okay? We're going to have to work on when I'm shopping with everybody and <laughs> vlogging at the same time. Journey walked out with all these cocoa melon toys. So, I need to tell y'all, we did end up going to Dee Dee's. I wish I would have found the Dr. Bronner's face, facial toner, but they did have the pink stuff inside. Mom. And Loki, I was like, am I going to buy this for real, for real? Mom. But you never know when this came up. So Journey ended up with all these cocoa melon stuff. She almost got every cocoa melon item out of there. Hey, y'all. Except for... Yo, yo, say hey to the yo-yo. Open that up for her, yo-yo. Except for she only just didn't get the bowling set. And then she got the plush, plushies of these. So we found this, which I thought, really, I was really just saying, like, as I was going through her hair stuff, like, I need to find something to put her hair stuff in. And I thought this is going to be perfect. So she got that. We got us a cutting board. I think this was like $7.99. This little bin thing was like $6.99. Journey's Kokomo toys was hella expensive. Um, the men, the little figurines were $8.99. The plush, the plush, this little thing with the, with this, freaking $14.99. And then all the trucks are seventeen, right? Yeah. The trucks are seventeen ninety nine. So we needed, y'all know, your girl needed a new what's the name? So we got one for like four ninety nine. Um, we just got some Febreze for three forty nine. Somehow these kids, I was gonna use this for my bathroom, y'all, and somehow <coughs> these kids convinced me to put this in their bathroom. So this five. Function dual head shower um, was $15.99. It's compared to $25. Yo yo ended up getting one of these flip cars. Somehow he always gets these those type of cars whenever we go out. Jada, I should have got me one. I'm low key like feels the type of way. She mad because I'm gonna be mess I'm gonna be sleeping with this when she gone. Got her a body pillow. I used to love body pillows. Um, and this thing was like, what? I need to know. They had another one like this, except it was purple, y'all. I should have got it, but I didn't. The body pillow was $10.99. And that looks like everything. So, um, it's Sunday evening. Wish I had my hair We up. had some great lunch at Applebee's, which y'all keep an eye out for. I didn't put it. It's not probably won't be in this vlog. But I think I'm just going to make like a separate, um, just like random moments with the GoPro. I'm still trying to figure out the the title in my head. But I think I'm going to make that just a separate video. While it's not going to be like a full, like, full day of, it's just like clips with the GoPro, basically. So, y'all will probably see our food on the GoPro video and... Yeah, me and the kids are just about to have some quality time together. Me and Jada are about to go and watch a show. I have eaten and how your girl want to roll up. Um, it's almost been like nappy time too. Y'all want a nap? Yo-Yo is making sure our girl get all of her. Y'all girl, y'all niece, y'all niece was in the DD. She didn't want to wear it. Well, no. We didn't put her shoes on because we thought she was going to sit in the cart. She didn't want to sit in the cart. She wanted to walk. So she had such dirty feet. Thankfully, I keep the wipes in the car, which y'all know. Um, you got anything for the vlog, Jada? Yeah. Jada got nothing for the vlog. Um, yeah. We'll probably see y'all tomorrow. If not tomorrow, later on this week. 
Do you mean the purple one? I know. I'm low-key, like, mad that I did not get it. But I think I just didn't get it because I'm still trying to figure out, like, the vibes from my room. Even though I feel like I'm going to get another bed set, but it's probably going to be black. But that's why I think that's why I didn't get it. Because I was like, is this going to match the, like, what am I trying to give off? But, nonetheless, Dee Dee's is there. And Dee Dee's, we're going to be back. Like, I'm going to say, we're going we're gonna to go back to Dee Dee's and see. What DDs be hitting on? Jada, Jada don't. Jada said, "What's DDs? Jada like the that's the ghetto stuff. That's the that's oh that's the off brand." What? I don't even know what they. were Could you even tell what they was arguing about? No. Yeah, exactly. I didn't know what that lady was in there hollering about or whatever. So. I'm surprised I didn't see a special guest in there. No mentioned. Please don't, cause you know people might you know be watching. Right. <laughs> our blogs and stuff weirdos you know don't want to be my friend don't want to talk to me but you know watching my blogs and stuff <laughs> I see you sis <laughs> you know how we do patty patty over here let me get off Jada pump me up y'all let me get off of here so we had a good lunch um, a good late lunch. I have no idea. It's definitely a fend for yourself type of dinner, y'all. So don't expect me to get up in there and cook nothing. I think I got a shift later on today. You got them all out? All right, well, make sure you just put the scissors. You might not even need no scissors for that. Yeah. Just make sure you put the scissors up. Because Johnny likes the... Their decorative stuff. I'm low-key, like, hating. Right? I'm low-key mad because I feel like the one in Texas, probably, honestly, everything in Texas is probably a whole lot better. Because I feel like that DD's like, I feel like Gina DD's always be just, like, hitting on something else. And that DD's is, like, it's cool, but, like, it ain't hitting on the DD's in Texas. Like Gina Janine's. It's okay, though. We walk, we came in, we, we walked out with some, with some iron little stuff. With some iron little stuff. I guess I gotta put this shower head together. But we do that later. Bye, y'all. I'm, I'm done talking to y'all. Bye, y'all. Bye, y'all. Bye. Bye, y'all. Bye. Y'all, I absolutely hate going to the dentist because I feel like, I feel like a child every time I go into the dentist is about to be scolded. Not that I was, like, it was, it, it was a good experience at the dentist. Like, I don't feel like they were getting after me for my lack of taking care of my teeth, I guess, so to speak, as best as I could be. Um... Yeah, I I I'm low-key embarrassed, but I'm I'm, I'm gonna tell y'all anyway. Um, so I have having having no issues with my teeth. I probably had I probably have um one issue with the teeth that's decaying or it's 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 broken. Really, that's that's what they say. It's broken or whatever. Whatnot. I was I'm ready. I might have slightly talked about how this tooth had been giving me pain or whatever. What I've been, I've been telling you, I told, I think I told you about this tooth. So, all right, cool. Um, you know, Medicaid ain't paying for you know nothing, no root canals, no da da da. So, like, all right, yeah, I'm like, yeah, you know, pull it, pulling it, you know, it's fine, whatever, whatever. Um, then they tell me that basically my gums is bad, like. Ever since I had the kids, in the, in the beginning, I was, I, I, okay, I probably say ever since probably having Ashton, I had gotten better with going to the dentist and making sure that I would, like, it's just to say that I had never been told anything about my gums, and now that's the thing. So, now I have to get a special cleaning, which they have to see if my insurance will even <laughs> my friends will even um will even cover it they have to do a um a pre-approval um they have a uh got a pre uh yeah they got to get a pre-approval through my insurance that's gonna take a couple of weeks like basically a month not even a couple of weeks it's basically gonna take a month she was like four weeks basically we ain't do nothing y'all but basically get my teeth looked at and i guess because of my gums and that's why they will do it to cleaning because I need to get the special cleaning or whatever or whatnot. So they're like, they're not bad, bad, but, um, I guess skating that fine line, like, you, you know, I don't, you, I do not want to walk in this dentist and come out with more issues and just 
and I can't, I'm just so emotional about it, y'all. Like, I can't get myself together. So, all right, and then that, and then I like, and then when the doctor came in, like, to start looking at teeth, and she's like, yeah, she's like, N naming off teeth, and I'm like, lady, I'm not about to have no teeth in my mouth. Mess with you, like, what? I'm in here like, oh, my God, I'm about to be walking around looking just so, <sighs> anyway, y'all, it won't nothing with my wisdom teeth. Basically, a lot of my wisdom teeth, um, basically uh it's like five it's four two two in the back and obviously that's where you will see the are two on each side and then plus my um i think plus uh this tooth that's broken they added that up to be five so i'm like yeah put me to sleep do they do it all at one time like five teeth is a lot of you know five teeth is a lot of teeth i'm thinking to be pulling out at one time then i'm like five teeth is a lot to be pulling out like to keep coming back and pulling girl i'm gonna go home and smoke <laughs> y'all like see actually that's your problem that's probably why you got bad teeth now i don't really know is it is smoking y'all like Okay, all right, that's it. So, so that's what we're dealing with with the dentist. Oh no! Then, 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 and it very well could have been because of this broken tooth or whatever or whatnot. But, girl, she basically told me walking around with stank breath, y'all. Like what? Um, she basically said I need to take my tongue ring out. So, y'all, I don't know whether you've noticed or not noticed all this time. I've had a tongue ring for decade decades now obviously you know i have been here for decades but um i have a tongue ring so she suggested that i is that i take it out um i don't know if she would say that that could be because she was she was said by the older so i don't know if it's the tooth i don't know if it's the tongue ring da, da, da. crazy thing was i was literally was just thinking about how i still have it and all my friends think I'm the only one who does have it. A couple of my friends, we had got it done together. And just, I'm just like, all right, is it is it already time to just be done with it and away with it and, and just to put it away? Matter of fact, are you the only person in this world that probably has a tongue? Well, no, like, I don't want to put put people in category. Like, gothic people and people are just in the piercings. Like, yeah, people do have it, but it's not like a a big of a thing as much as it was as like it was at one time how everybody wanted to have their tongue pierced everybody had a tongue ring whatever so this will be the last time i actually meant to take it out before i started this video um but so i'm not matter of fact, we're gonna go ahead and take it out together at the same time i only want to because i'm just embarrassed about my teeth as a whole and at the same time i feel like maybe is that why uh they Oh, they do look a little dark, though, actually, on your gums. Just like here in the front. Like, y'all, like, my gums are, like, dark. Like, all right, let's see. Let's let's take it out together. But I don't like how it looks. I'm going to take this part out. Well, let's go ahead and go. And it's out, y'all. And it's out. Girl's growing up. She gotta get her whole mouth together. And no more tongue ring. Hey, babes. Happy Thursday. Um, I need to come on and update y'all and as well in this vlog. It seems like I be ending vlogs on Thursdays. And then by around this time, I'll be ready. I've done enough footage that I can go ahead and set up to... I don't know. Things seem to be working here. It's random. It's mad awkward. It's not like at the beginning or the ending of like a week or... Either way, it seems to be working right now. So we just gonna flow with it. But um, I had to come on here and... Like I said, in the vlog, but as well give y'all some updates. As you can see, I might look a little funny, maybe or maybe not. Um, because this eye is always just a little bit lazier than this one. Um, but I got freaking pink eye, y'all. Just when I even the crazy thing was, even when I was thinking that the kids did not 
were, you know, they were no longer having pink eye. I was still taking precautions, but I think at some point I slipped and my hands was all in my face. And then literally Monday came and I was like, why does my, is my eye just so juicy? And I remember having my hand in my face so many times on Monday. And I ended up just going and looking in the mirror and boom, gunk in the corner of my eye. And I'm like, let's just start the medication. I went on and dropped uh, a couple of, a drop or two in my eye and, you know, just been on it since. It's getting better. Um, I didn't woke up with it shut, you know, closed shut. Um, and then I turn around and then, yeah, and like, there must be another virus going around because, and I could have chucked it up very well to the Pizza Hut that we had Monday, but, but, Jay didn't have the Pizza Hut Monday. Jada didn't eat the pizza. So she woke up early Tuesday morning throwing up. I didn't even know until she came home and she told me. And then Tuesday evening, all of a sudden, my stomach was just, I'm all kinds of ashy per usual. My stomach was just all tore up, all tore up, all tore up. And I'm like, oh my gosh, is it the McDonald's? Is it the, you know, the what's the name that I had? Uh, you know, the fish fillet, like, I threw up, like, four or five times yesterday. I couldn't keep anything down, anything down. Today is not Thursday. Today is Wednesday. I'm so sorry. I just realized today is definitely Wednesday, not Thursday. Um, so, but still, we're still going to end the vlog here. So, um, yeah, y'all. I had nothing going on the past couple of days besides pink eye and then a virus. And then Ashton was like, his stomach was hurt and he didn't throw up though. He woke up fine this morning. So that's that y'all. So I need to, um, I just dropped Journey off at daycare. I'm about to go to the house, uh, go back to the house. I need to make a phone call. One, Jada had a referral from the dentist that I need to call about. I need to call about my referral. Um, and... I need to go over expenses. Go over the financials. I want to say expenses. I say go over the financials. Uh, I know I, I did like a, a set of AC8, so I need to make sure that what's in there is supposed to be in there. Um, and then I need to set up a couple of, yeah. I just go with financials. Y'all don't know what that means. Bills is due. Couple bills due. I'm going to get a late fee for during the daycare because so much going on. I wasn't feeling good yesterday. So I forgot to set up the during payment. Like, I need to get it back on auto pay, but not right now. 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 So, um, that's our day, y'all. I have a shift with Amazon Flex. Uh, we may or may not go shopping for Journey today. Her dad sent me some money to get her um, some clothes. Because, you know, she's just getting tall. Just growing out of everything. So, that's the update on this. Good on Wednesday. But we're ending the vlog here. And I'll see y'all in the next vlogging day at the start of another vlog. Peace y'all, love y'all. Make sure you give yourself grace, give others grace. If you're new and you enjoy what you saw here or you just wanna see more, go catch some other videos, you know? Or as well, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit the like, like this video y'all. Appreciate it, appreciate it, appreciate it. Sister said KK, I'm not sure if she's saying KK too, but um, yeah, I think we out to you now. Dropping on the beat. Fools like them, they suck me up.